Hey guys, today I'm going to show you the perfect settings that you can have in Hightail. Let's get straight into it. So we're going to go through all the video settings. Um, first of all, I'm also going to show on most of the settings uh, a good and the like the best and the worst uh, option you can choose with the, the side with the plus is always the best one. The side with the minus is always the worst one. Um, here with full screen sync, unlimited FPS and maximum FPS, you can just copy these settings. So it should be fine uh, for everyone. Then we're going to go into custom settings here, graphic preset. I have the view distance around here. Um, it doesn't matter too much, even though if you set the view distance higher, you can't see that far. Um, so it's fine if you put it here. And the higher you put it, the worse your game will run. So I would recommend like something between 3 and 400 should be fine. Um, this is probably render scale, the most important setting here. Um, yeah, I have it on 100 because like it's you see a very, very big difference here uh, between 50 and 100. And even if you go a little bit below 100, you will immediately see some uh, yeah some quality uh, punishments. So I would definitely recommend taking render scale at 100. Yeah. Then we go into word detail. No, not a big difference because between lowest or maximum, I can't even see one. Um, so we can leave this on lowest. Same for anti-aliasing, almost no difference. Mm, then we have shadow quality. I have it on high because there are some, yeah, differences in in the shadow quality. Obviously, as you can see in the screenshot, it's hard to see um, if you don't have it like on top of each other pictures. Um, but I have it on high because there are differences, but you can leave it on low because there are not big differences. Same for particle quality, um, no, not the same. This is also again, no difference, so we can leave it. I've also tested it on lava, but haven't seen any differences. Then shading quality, same, no differences here. Um, bloom, we can leave off. And then we have foliage fading. There are some minor differences. If you look into the background, like you see the grass is a little bit taller and stuff. Um, so I left foliage fading on. It looks a little bit better, but also no big differences. Um, and then we have depth puffer precision. We can also leave this on low because there are no big differences here. One thing probably that you could do is field of view. So you have a bigger field of view. I like to have this option um, on a high scale. Um, yeah, but that's it. So yeah, don't forget to subscribe and see you in my next video. Bye.